one owner car guy, one owner car guy .com. No matter what, when I start out to do something, it seems like everything goes off base. Kind of like this here tire. That's got a new single B booby. But I know why it, oops. Wow, did it actually go down overnight? Or did I get a lug nut under it? Ow. And that's exactly how that happened with that tire. Ow, man. That hurt. That's where I'm having my problem is the tire is rubbing right there. Look at that. Damn. And when I put my hand there, I just kind of scraped it pretty good. But that's what I'm saying. No matter what I do around here, it seems like there's just more to do. I bought some cars at auction, so I was very happy to go be picking up the cars. And then once I got hooked up to the trailer, realized not so cool. Okay, oh, I want to show you guys something while I'm making a video right over here. This is amazing, actually. I mean, I'm very, God, I really smashed that finger. Really am lucky. Look at this. This was standing up and the windstorm went whoosh. And look at this, man. I just barely, and look, they're not broke. They might have pulled that down out of there. I think it did. It should be able to be pushed back. But these TVs didn't even break. And they got the big glass front, man. Yeah, it did pull it down a little bit. I'm going to have to clip that back up in there. But luckily, it didn't break anything. Pull poke go by every day when I'm walking out here. Okay, well, I'm going to get the Mustang. I believe the tranny's rebuilt and sitting in the office. Haven't seen Rich in about four weeks. Well, in fact, since the day that my woman and kids went to San Diego, the last day he showed up was the day before they left. So getting help out here is not, he's got other stuff going on. Getting help out here lately ain't been that easy. I gotta get a hammer and do some body work on this thing here. Hammer, that looks like a hammer to me. Ah. So, yeah, I don't know much else. I know that I like it. That'll work too. I was looking at this guy's C4 next to me, and then when he went in the store, his doggy jumped out. You're a good doggy. Yeah, you're a good doggy. We're gonna. I gotta make sure this dog stays here. He was starting to go out in the street, and I got all worried. Poor doggy. She hopped out the minute you got over. I called for you, but but she just she just chilled out and let me pet her. I didn't want her to run out in the street, bro. She just hop right out, yeah. Dude, those aren't gonna do no, nothing but go up in value, man. Oh, I know. It's an 85. 85? Like, I just got it. Like, I've sold probably 80 of those in my life, and like, it's just, they're gonna do nothing but go up in value. All right. Back at the auction. You know, I knew he'd buy that. How's it going, man? Long time no see. Yeah, long time no see. What are you up to? Nothing. Just bring some shit here. Yeah? For auction? Or?
Hey, did you know that they're closed for until the 12th after today? Yeah, probably. I didn't, I, I didn't know. I just thought I'd tell you. They just found that out. No. Yeah, I figured that. I was thinking of debating that. I was going to take that wagon home today, and I brought a little, I said, I'll put it on a car dolly. What did that go for? That's a steal, dude. Yeah, I think I, I think I can sell it for like three grand. I, uh, I mean, small. I have a clue what it's worth. But I, mean, I was thinking 35 when I was uh, 25 to 35, because I mean, it's a small town wants that for parade or yeah. fire yeah, department. I like the rubber tire, the car tires, because you can you can you know just change the tires. You didn't get one of the other ones. Wheels, no. That Surrey was a deal, man. What did it go for? It's fucking 925 bucks. That thing's like five grand. It's a nice. <laughs> you just gotta have time to do it all. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, no. It wouldn't start for me. No, it, it, they listed it. They said it had fuel issues, and I didn't hear the pump kicking on. Oh. And I, I also... I turned it over, and it fired one second, and then it went down. So I was like, well, got to at least have a good coil pack in it. Like, it's crazy what those go for now. Any, yeah. Any of these body styles are crazy money, and square bodies are off the roof. I put no, not for sale on all my fucking square bodies. I just got tired of that talking to people. All day long, they want to pay $1,200 for one. Like, I they remember they're, going they're fucking that. 10 grand with a, with a, a shitty set of big wheels on them uh, and a shitty paint job. And they're 30 grand fully restored, you know. And everybody wants to like, whoa, okay. Okay, so I got the Chevy three-quarter ton out. It's a clean little truck. I'll probably paint the wheels on that. <laughs> but I got the Malibu or Monte Carlo started up and let it warm up a bit. Actually, not too long, or I'll run out of gas. So I'm gonna pull it around, I guess. God, they got stuff stacked up like crazy. All the containers are full of stuff to auction. They're so far behind. And I can't. I've got so much stuff to sell, I should probably quit buying. He can't get the pedals to work on the thing. He bought this little trailer too. It is sweet. Okay. I gotta get this thing cranked up now. Crank her up. Where the hell? Oh no. No, no, no. Oh, there we go. Huh, I got two of them. This one might be, take the longer one. Oh, this one's way better. That's, um... Okay, I'm gonna take this off and get this bad boy loaded up. <clears throat> that thing's been here for 20 years as a pothole patcher. Carries around asphalt and stuff. The siding machine, man, I don't think, I had plans to do this place, but right now, just like it's been for the past few years, Getting help is not really an easy thing. People are people. I'll just leave it at that. People are people. So, yeah, I got everybody fed. And this is the arrow sign. Need a couple replacement things there. But that's the deal. I don't know what else to say besides here we are. And this is what we're doing. It's happening. Well, if you see anything around you're interested in, give me a call. It's more than likely for sale. There's only a, really a car here that's not. And it's time to keep on cleaning. That's all I do anymore is clean, it seems. Well, that's all I've done for five years, probably. Three years. Crazy. What are you doing, girl? What are you doing?